Hey everybody, this is week 32 of 2023 and uh, we're going to start off with the smoke of the week. This I'm very excited about. This is the Romeo e Julieta 1875 and this is named after the Shakespearean love story and tragedy. Uh, this is a medium bodied profile making it accessible to not only novice but seasoned smokers as well. Dominican filler and binder and an Indonesian wrapper that adds a bit of sweetness. Inside you're gonna get creamy and toasty flavors with uh, notes of cedar, nuts, and some subtle spices. So here we go, let's spark her up. Okay, so my week in real estate. Monday, uh, Monday morning, got right after it, got, went over to the gym in uh, Mission Beach, Fit. It's my first time there. I met a friend of mine and also a fellow uh, lender in the industry. Shout out to Jeremiah, had a great workout in. Um, I like that uh, facility over there. They got the rooftop deck, it's really cool. And then Monday night, basketball. I've been playing basketball since I was a kid. I, I hadn't played it for a good stretch of 10 years. And then when I came out here, um, connected with another commercial real estate uh, broker here downtown, uh, connected with him, became good friends with him. And then now we play on the same basketball team at Muni Municipal Courts in Balboa. So that was Monday night. Um, and I also play Saturday mornings at OB. So, and that's kind of like a pickup style. So if you're ever looking to get out on the court, that's where I'll be Saturday mornings most, most weekends. Tuesday, I had my coaching call um, that went well. Consistency again is super important and we set goals for and tasks for every single week to complete. Also, Tuesday through Thursday, um, I, I was eating, my first meal was at four o'clock. And I'll tell you, like those days, those, those I consider the prime days of the week for just for business. Tuesday, I mean, Monday's important too, every day's important, but Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday specifically. And so I like waiting until later, like four o'clock, to have my one and only meal of the day. I'm so much more efficient. Food tends to slow me down, even if it's healthy food. Once I start eating, I just start to get lethargic. Maybe some of that is a placebo, but um, it's also just the fact that I already know ahead of time that I'm gonna be skipping lunch and working right through the day. Um, I get a lot more done, and I tend to just work better when I'm slightly irritable as well. And then when that meal does come around at four o'clock, I am so much more grateful and appreciative of that meal. I enjoy it more, and I spend a little bit longer time eating, so I'll grill, and I'll spend a whole hour just eating slowly. I may uh, read a book, make some phone calls, I catch up with people, so I really appreciate that time of uh, eating, that eating window. Wednesday, I met my photographer at an upcoming listing that'll be going live this week, most likely on Thursday. It's a really nice newer townhome constructed in 2021 down in uh, Otay Mesa, 92154. Super nice, we're gonna be listing most likely around 670,000. It's a four bed, three bath, almost 1,700 square feet townhome. Beautiful, so it should sell pretty quickly. Uh, then I had on Thursday an amazing discovery call with a, uh, a client that was referred to me from a previous client. And I'll tell you, as a realtor, we all wanna work off of referrals, so that is, if you like your realtor, give them <laughs> referrals. That's the very best gift you can give them, and we are so appreciative of them. Friday morning, uh, I went and trained at Ocean Pacific Gym in PB. Luckily, I have a friend that trains there. He's able to, to guest pass me there uh, once a week, so we typically would train Friday mornings. That gym's really cool, too. It's also right on the coast there, so it has views and they also have a cold plunge as well. So we like getting there early in the morning and using the cold plunge before you know, everyone else uses it that day. They, they clean out the filters every day, but we still wanna be the first ones in there. And then uh, this weekend, I just honed down and filmed content um, for the majority of the next couple weeks. So I'd like to knock out all my content and planning for the weeks ahead during the weekend, so then when it's time to work during the week and I'm following up with people, that's what I'm focusing on is um, client you know, retention, prospecting, follow up for um, people that are actively looking for homes or looking to sell, so that's what the week should be used for. If you have any questions about buying or selling, investing, or just wanna to touch base on a personal level, reach out. 
Um, I put these out every week, so I will talk to you guys soon. Have a great week.